Hey guys, it's Let Your Light Shine. We got Sarah, we got Jackson, we got Steve-O. Oh, yeah. It's Christmas and we are spending it where? Vegas? Got quite a line for the old Vegas sign. Can't miss it. They have parking now so you can actually park and see this. Nice little parking spot. You got, you got pictures with Elvis. Fun stuff. So we're staying at the Tropicana. I just wanted to show you some of the decor here on Christmas Day. Christmas tree. Some pretty poinsettia decor. And there are, I would say, fake palm trees. So we're in the back tower because my cheap butt didn't want to pay the extra 15 bucks to stay in the tower by the casino. So you got to work for that. Oh, yeah. So at the front, when you check in, you see this big old ornament, and then you see these beautiful wreaths, and then this awesome Christmas tree. All right, we're right in front of the New York, New York, across the street actually, and Sarah pointed out the Christmas tree on top. How cute. Well, if you want to think of this as Christmassy, well, the traffic is kind of Christmassy. It's pretty, right? Traffic is terrific. And here's the backside of traffic. All right, so we are currently in the Excalibur Casino, and they have also Christmas decorations here. So we're just like right where you enter. Very nice. All right, so we are in the New York, New York casino, and so far this is what I have captured. Very pretty. Um, I haven't seen anything else Christmassy in this casino yet. But it's still pretty, and I like to look at it. And I like this casino, so there you go. All right, guys, so we're eating at Wolfsburg's Monkey Pucks. It's not decked out too Christmasy, although the employees are wearing ugly sweaters and lit up little lights on their little sweaters there. They're pretty Christmas music, so there we go. Other than that, I didn't see too much Christmas decorations. Too much around the casino, just a little bit here and there. That's all I got for the MGM brand, but here, we're hungry and we want to eat, so there you go. All right, walking out of the MGM Grand, we're still here, but I saw Showgirl Christmas, so there you go. That's different. Okay, I'm in the lobby area of the MGM Grand, so yeah, I guess they did deck it out a little bit for Christmas, so there you go. People are taking pictures, so there you go, but anyway, we're doing selfies. Yay. So that's pretty. And that's about it. All right, we're back at New York, New York. Just throwing out, they're blaring out Christmas music. And there is the Statue of Liberty representing the hockey team of Las Vegas. Oh yeah. And flag. All right, this isn't that Christmassy, but we are taking the tram to the Luxor. Really fun. It's I kind of, understand. we took it from the Excalibur to the Mandalay Bay, and now the backtrack to the Luxor. So, there we go. And Sarah wants to stand the whole time. I want to stand. It's actually kind of fun. It's still ringing. Please hold on to a oh, handrail. snap, it's going. <laughs> it's just us in here. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> 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 <Dad>, stop. <laughs> 
Oh yeah. Okay, even though it's not Christmassy, the Luxor is just one heck of a cool place. And you know what? Why not? They're lit up. Merry Christmas. Look at that. They got their, well, I don't think they have their Christmas signal up, but they got something up. <laughs> they got something up. Very, very high. All right, we are in the lobby of the Luxor, one of my favorite casinos, and they have a Christmas tree. How nice. Yay. Other than that, I don't see anything else Christmassy. But that's okay because the Luxor is just a really cool place. Never mind, I found it. Alright, maybe not Christmas decor, but it's so pretty. We're at the Luxor Esports Arena. Where all the gamers hang out. There's a bar at the end here, and there was also a bar up here. It's not at the moment open, but I just thought that was kind of cool. And just, what the heck is that? And then like, what is this seriousness going on? Is this like the, the gamers of the century come up here and play? And what goes on these screens? I just don't know. But Merry Christmas to you. So even though it's not decked out in Christmas colors, it is so beautiful that it could be Christmassy. And there we go. We're walking back to the old Tropicana because that's where we're staying. And uh, hopefully I'll see more Christmassy stuff tomorrow. And if not, then we'll just end the vlog. So we shall see. All right, so it's day number two. I am still in pursuit for say holiday lights. We just passed the MGM Grand. See, it's right here. There we go. And this building is quite intriguing. Earlier it had like a 3D thing going on. So right across from New York, New York. Across from me is the Bellagio and I just noticed the Christmas tree up here. We're not going to be able to hit every casino because I'm getting tired, so I know, that I think the Bellagio has a really pretty botanical garden in there. I'm sure it's all decked out and Christmassy. So, there you go. The whole place is lit up anyway. So, it's Christmas all year round here in Vegas. All year round. All right, we're in some kind of mall by the Planet Hollywood in Paris Casino, and I saw this on another YouTube channel called the Tipsy Robot. This is where you have, you actually purchase your drink on one of these kind of iPad things, and they make your drink for you, and it's very expensive. All right, I want to watch these guys make a drink. Oh, no, no one's ordering anything. Darn. I guess you can, like, customize your drink, though. And all the alcohol is up there. Pretty cool stuff. Oh, he's doing something.
up when he gets his drink. Oh, there it goes. I'm like, I got the Bellagio water going here. It's all year round. It's not just Christmas, but... You can see it from here. There we go. There goes the whole fountain. Nice. I'm trying to do the no double chin. That's why I have you look at that. Yeah, it's in the, it's still no, not working out. Anyway, we're back at the Tropicana, 14th floor. I'll show you my view because it's a pretty cool view of the strip. Oh, hello. Hi. So anyway, as you saw, I kind of did other things other than Christmas stuff because yeah. I'm not gonna walk the whole entire strip and find all the Christmas stuff because I know there's a lot I missed and I didn't want to spend the money to look for stuff that you have to spend money on either. So anyway, I spent enough money here. Anyway. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you soon. Bye. Bye. I don't want to stick my phone out there. But this is our view. Yeah, see, we got the back tower. You know why? Because it's cheaper. I mean, I could pay 15 more bucks to be in the front. But I didn't feel like it. I wanted to walk the mile out of the casino lobby entrance every time because that's how I roll. But yeah, we walked, yeah, we should have, because we walked all the way to the uh, Paris Hotel, which is way over there. I can't even see it. That's how far it is. Back, oh, we and then we walked back. back. Thank God they have these bridges and stuff. Whew. Anyway, that's all. Bye, everybody. Bye. Hope you had a Great happy Christmas. holiday, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Kwanzaa. and Kwanzaa, and all others. I have not mentioned. Yes, Bye. Happy Halloween.